Hello, what's up guys, it is Hells Jerome here and today is the first time I've done a commentary with uh, somebody home so uh, so it's kind of it's kind of strange having people having people running around um, and potentially listening well it's not like my family just runs around so <laughs> family just run around everywhere like ah, I've got to go clean the dishes, ah, I've got to answer the phone well actually we kind of do run for the phone, well not anymore but Back in the day, I think we'd have a race to answer the phone when it was ringing. But now I couldn't give a shit. I don't want to answer it. We're like, we're like, uh, you've got the fuck. That guy just disappeared. Um, yeah, we're just like, you can answer the phone. I don't, I don't want to because I don't want to talk to people. Fuck people. All, pe all people want when they call is to t is to talk to mum and just like, hi, is um, is insert mum's name here, and um, it's always her. The phone's never for me because nobody loves me. So. Anyway, I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. That is not what I was here to talk about. What I'm talking about today is annoying couples. And I say this because yesterday I was going to... I was going to the city. I was going to the football. The AFL Aussie Rules. And, um... Fuck, this game is so loud in my ear. I need to turn that down. Just bear with me a second. Is that down? Ow! Oh, shit, that was the wrong way. That made it really loud. Um... Yeah, so anyway, I was on the train yesterday... And I was with my um, with my father and my brother and sister because it was Father's Day, and this couple were like next to us on the chair, and they were just fucking so annoying. Like, just this girl, this this couple, and um, I don't know, they're like fifteen or something, and everything she said would be so fucking annoying. Like, she'd be like, <laughs> she'd just be like, I don't know if she was laughing or crying or what but she just couldn't talk normally she was just oh it was fucking annoying she just like <laughs> stop that stop that and I'm just sitting there looking at my brother we're just like just rolling our eyes at this stupid fucking 15 year old I don't know how old she was but god it was so annoying so yeah like basically if you if you're in a couple I want you to listen now don't be fucking don't be annoying. Oh, I was going for like montage clips or something but failing what if I go for it again no, I didn't even shoot. Pussy doubt. Um, so yeah, so yeah. Anyway, um, if you're in a if you're in a relationship with somebody, you know, keep that shit to yourself. Don't don't be sitting on trains and being annoying and stuff because that just oh, I couldn't concentrate because I just had this girl just whining in my ear the whole time and that was really annoying. People are disappearing in this game. I can't re really remember much about it, but people just keep disappearing and shit. It's confusing me. I don't know if it's confusing you guys, but it's confusing the shit out of me. So anyway, and also another thing that annoys me is obnoxious people. Like, we're at the footy end. This is just Australia for you. You know, you have people all around you just cheering and shit. And I don't know if they think that the umpires can hear them or if the players can hear them, but they... Sh I don't know. They sure fucking seem like it. There's this guy sitting behind us. He has nobody with him. He's all by himself. And he's yelling out at the, at the refs or the umpires, whatever you call them, just like, for everything. They'd be like, oh, you you fucking idiot and there's like kids around and shit and they just they just yell just stuff like no scope bitch um they don't s yell no scope bitch they yell footy related um things i don't know those umpires man they cop a lot of shit because like everybody's against them no matter like what the decision is if it's against your team people just get nuts they just get so pissed off and um i just zoned out then for a sec i was just saying shit so, so yeah, people, people are loud, people are annoying, and, um, another thing that was annoying, there was this kid behind me, and kids, I don't know if I was like this, but this kid behind me, just, like, he had his foot up, feet up on my chair, and was just kicking me, like, kicking the chair, kicking me, and being so loud, and this kid, he's obviously gonna be one of those kids later when he's older, because he was so influenced, like, as soon as his dad would yell out something, this kid would just say it, and every time that would happen in the game, he would just say it. And it was so freaking annoying. Like, I think once the the other team they um screwed up the kick or something, and the dad was like, "Oh, Chewy on the boot," and this kid the whole game every time they'd be going for goal, he'd be like, "Chewy on the boot, Chewy on the boot." And I don't even think he knew what it meant. I don't even know what the shit it means. I guess he had chewing gum on his football boot. I don't know how that would really alter the um the outcome of your kick. But but oh well. <laughs> so anyway, um, guys. I, on the weekend, I started the edit for my montage, which I've spoken about a few times, and that will be out, I'd like to say, 
next week. I'll probably be able to uh, give you an exact date when it will be coming out. It's a Black Ops. It's not a montage, sorry. It's a dual tage with my mate Trent. And the, ep- the, the, the edit so far is freaking awesome. Like, it's just, it's just so cool. I don't know. It's just cool for me to see. And um, I just got sniped. Probably deserved it. So, yeah, anyway, guys, um, be sure to follow me on Twitter and shit because I've been tweeting on there lately. So, follow me on Twitter, add me on the PlayStation or Xbox. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys next week.